Thank you very much. I'm Dr. Kevin Cavanaugh from HealthWatch USA. We're a nonprofit patient advocacy organization uh, whose mission is to uh, reduce uh, healthcare associated infections and uh, multi resistant drug organisms. Uh, we are very concerned that surveillance has been uh, underutilized. Uh, to paraphrase the Union of uh, Concerned Scientists, uh, we feel that this could be characterized as a downplaying of evidence and the playing up of false uncertainty. A lot of the false uncertainty we feel has been created by uh, two studies. One, the STAR ICU study, where uh, surveillance cultures were not checked for five days. The other, a JAMA Swiss study, where uh, the vast, well, where over a majority of individuals going for surgery that were MRSA uh, positive did not receive appropriate antibiotics effective against MRSA. And this is uh, comparing to numerous, almost 40 studies that are before and after studies which showed surveillance to be effective, along with uh, three other studies that have been well controlled, also having positive results. We're also very concerned about chlorhexidine and the universal use of chlorhexidine and whether or not it is uh, effective. Uh, as you probably uh, know, uh, chlorhexidine was a center point of a $40 million Department of Justice settlement and allegations of $11 million kickbacks, which surrounded both um, recommendations uh, 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 from NQF and also a 2010 study in New England J Journal of Medicine that compared uh, chlorhexidine plus uh, alcohol to iodine alone. Uh, we're also very concerned about changes in metrics, which uh, we observed in the REDUCE MRSA study, uh, which uh, evolved about, which, which analyzed a universal uh, uh, use of chlorhexidine. Uh, we're concerned just about the effectiveness of chlorhexidine itself. At least one researcher found uh, no evidence that chlorhexidine without alcohol was effective, and that most of the research has centered around uh, chlorhexidine plus alcohol being compared to iodine an unfair two against one comparison. Bacterial resistance is a, a huge concern. Uh, this can take um, decades uh, to be noted. It's unlikely to be picked up by any one study. Uh, in addition, uh, chlorhexidine uh, resistance or reduced susceptibility has recently been implicated in both central line infections and uh, in failure of MRSA decolonization. Uh, one researcher has uh, even implicated it in the uh, multi-resistant drug uh, Klebsiella uh, epidemic. And in summary, uh, we are very concerned as an organization about research integrity, uh, changes in metrics after trial initiation, uh, that all data is reported, uh, that we compare new therapy to existing and current therapies, uh, that we do fair comparisons between uh, uh, one agent to one agent, not two agents to one, the proper interventions given to uh, patients who are known carriers, and that if a test is ordered, the results are readily available, and that conflicts of interest are declared. Uh, thank you.